It's time. It's 3 a.m. at the Krusty Krab. I'm pretty sure this is the same guy who's been making the Scooby-Doo games. And the, um, I don't know. Other games in this vein. Oh my god. The frames are bad. I can't even play SpongeBob, man. So I'm 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 Mr. Crab. Counting my money. On a dark, rainy night underwater. Are there some uh, I don't even think there's options I can change. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it goes with the game, alright? The frames are okay. Oh no. I can't even get through this. Gather all me money from the cash register and from me office. Pack the leftover Krabby Patties, check the bathroom trash bin for any pennies. Lock up and leave. It's cinematic, yeah. What the fuck was that? <laughs> Alright. You know what? Let's turn this down. You, you know there's gonna be some jump scare. Hold on. When the lights are flickering, you need to hide. The lights are just flickering. There we go. Is that the hash slinging slasher? Uh, what? What the fuck is that? What the fuck is a hash slinging slasher? Honestly, the, the Krabby Patty place just makes me hungry because any like quasi kind of burger place in a cartoon. Delicious. It's from SpongeBob. Okay. I'm not well versed in the SpongeBob. So come on, dude. Keep up on your SpongeBob lore. This is like banana. Oh, it's bamboo. The Honker Burger, for instance. Yes. Wait, what was that sound? Right, I'm checking the bins for pennies. That's what I'm doing. Oh, dude, this is just like, like, Rust or, or Tarkov. Choky Chicken, what was that, Rocco's Modern Life? We got ourselves a fake Spongebob fan! Man, I'm surprised there aren't more... Dink fan games. For a minute, like last year, when the Dink meme was like at its pinnacle, especially in like the Vine Sauce community. Oh shit, dude. It's fucking after me. There were some Dink games coming out, but they were just fucking awful. And, uh, like, you know, they kind of got shut down a little bit. So, it kind of killed the Dink, the Dink games. They weren't good games, though. Like, if someone who knew something about Doug went out and made one like that, it'd be great. Oh, there's like a trap door next to his, his office. Let's take all the money. Like, I unironically enjoy Doug Funny and all properties related to it, man. I just, I live that life. You can never take that away from me. Pack the leftover Krabby Patties. Gather all me money. Okay, I just need the Krabby Patties. I couldn't go through this. Okay, now I can.
I think he's here. <clears throat> hey, what's up, bunny? So, what's up, danger locker? So, would you call yourself a Dughead? No! I think that was scripted. I don't think there's any way out of here. There's no door from Mr. Krabs' office into the kitchen, and or you have like the layout of the Krabby Patty in your mind. I guess some people do have it pretty well uh, memorized. There's like a fucking TTT map for it and shit, isn't there? There's a TTT map, there's a... I'm sure there's like several Counter-Strike maps for it. Hey, Dugheads! It's episode 52 of the Doug Dead Pod- Isn't that a real podcast? Isn't that where the fucking- Isn't that- I think that is a real YouTube channel. I feel like I found that one time. There's a YouTube channel that has a Doug podcast. I swear to God. I think it had something to do with the Ev Doug Evangelion uh, video. What's up, mackerel? What's going on, Zito? Hey, what's up, Trina? Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. No! Ah, oh, son of a bitch. That's, well, that's all I had to do, right? Was just leave. Lock up. Oh, I didn't think I locked up. Gather all the money. What, what constitutes locking up? Also, he has a trap door. Is that a safe? There's a pod... He's looking around out there. There's a podcast where every episode they watch Grown Ups 2. <laughs> that actually sounds like hell. Yeah, I think closing all the doors because they have like little wooden stocks on them. I was just telling someone the other day, like, David Spade. What happened there? Was it only the was it only the movies with Chris Farley that David Spade was good in? All right. Oh yeah, Joe Dirt. Bitch. Does he have to like make eye contact with me? Oh yeah, then he was on a sitcom. For, what sitcom was he? He was like on, uh... Shit. Nope! Alright, I'm gonna try this one more time. Speaking of Will Ferrell, he did like the opening monologue to SNL last week, and uh, he was president to be he was trying to be George W. and he was talking about how you know he rebuilt the Oval Office in his basement and he was going to address his audience on Twitch. I just thought that was awesome. I think Twitch that's the first time Twitch has gotten like mentioned as a joke like on some fucking actual show like that. The cash register, okay. Alright. 
He's like out there. Think... Oh, no shit. Escape from Krustov. I keep clicking outside the window. Shit! Close the door! I don't think he can get through that. Oh, thank God. Did me a fright. What's up, Dr. Professor? Find the key in the basement. What? The basement? That must have been the door next to the desk. Hey, what's up, Frazier? How you doing? Alright, hopefully that this is this is like a checkpoint. And I don't have to do the first part of the game over again. Was there an episode where Mr. Crab had to go into his basement and find a key? And there's just like boxes upon boxes stored away back there. Oh shit, 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 Did I get away? Yeah, you're getting the whole experience by this being in 5 FPS, okay? It's a little thing called Hollywood, Harg. You may have heard of it. This is how everything is in the movies. No, god damn it, where's the where's the door? How do I get out of here? What's up, Darren? How you doing, dude? He knew it was in Mr. Crab's office immediately. I missed out on this generational cultural thing with SpongeBob. I feel like I missed out. Son of a bitch, it's a dead end! You walk past the ladder? God damn it. Andor, how are you? God damn it! No, no! Oh, it doesn't end like this. All right, thank God they didn't start me over completely. Oh well, fuck you. What? Andor actually made this game. Oh, the key was here last time, wasn't it? I am 118. But I'm also a hobbit, so we age differently than you humans do. A grueling diet of of hobbit leaf and uh, you know pies has kept me very young. Oh fuck! This is just a dead end. This is so fucking stacked against me. Andor, how could you make this game?
Did he just see me and walk away? Oh my god! My. Yeah, every frame is incredibly dense. Right here, look at this. The atmosphere. The way that Mr. Crab grips his flashlight. Oh my god, this guy is such a dick. How is he I am constantly? The keys in the basement. You must find it. What the fuck, man? What the fuck? Fast as death. Yeah. That's actually a category. Oh my god. No. Nope. I'm dead. There's no way I'm gonna get away from this. It's actually a category of Monstrum. Oh no! Gear! Thanks for that big host, dude. What's going on, man? Alright. Now where are we? This is a this is a real character in, in SpongeBob, this guy with like a fucking knife. And he slings hash, you're saying? Oh dude. Fucking did it. You have the key, now go outside and lock up. It's never gonna be that easy though, is it? Just make a beeline for the door. Now get to the boat and escape! Where's the boat? Right here? Oh man, we did it! He's chasing the car! It's like T2. Well, that was kind of anticlimactic. I was expecting like some dumb shit to happen at the end. Long story short, SpongeBob stayed up watching a horror movie and it turns out he's the dude who wants some food and the person who's flicking the lights is Nosferatu. Oh, okay. Yeah. I don't know why I never got into that show. Huh. Alright. Next game. Next game. Hmm. <laughs> I kind of want to play something that isn't as bad, I guess. But I think these are all pretty bad. Jesus Christ. Let me just go ahead and turn that down. What kind of music even is that? <laughs> this one's called Your Last Day. Your Last Day. Is that a little battery meter that's like cut in half at the top of the right hand? The top right hand? Oh my god, it was like... It was, in the screen, it was in the frame from the very beginning. What the fuck? Again, very dense frames. 
What the fuck? Great place to start out. It's my 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 blood bucket. Very cool. So get so good. Shit buckets. This door is locked. What what the fuck is this? Why is it E on a on a circle? Is it gonna be like a QTE thing? Just walking through the same room over and over again. The game's at 50%. How could it still be so loud? I'm just going into the same room over and over again. Oh, the, the, the pot fell over. What is what meme is that when the person's doing that with their face? Without their skin falling off. Um Okay. Hey, what's up, Bell? The key to my heart is yours now. This is fucking bad. What is this? Look at this. A common hotel key. What? You shouldn't be afraid of love. But there's more words there. Oh, look how symmetrical this one is. I love it. What is this? Is this like supposed to be a PT clone? Is that really what's happening here? But it's just like the like poorest example I've ever seen. Okay, we got we got a door open here. Why did you leave me? I loved you. <laughs> is this how they're doing this? This is so weird. Behind you? No, no I'm not looking behind me. Something just pushed me. Did you hear that? Like something just spawned in and it pushed me up a little bit. Oh, the wall changed. Uh. Do you see that? There's like something red between... Is 
be something out there. Volume cranked. Fuck me up. You saw Jeff the Killer? Oh. What? I, what? Oh, now there's physics. Jesus Christ. Look at this line here. This is like that episode of Cops when that guy was on bath salts and he was trying to tell the cops that there was a fiber optic line running through his driveway. This is probably what he saw. They're running optic lines everywhere. Right there. Sir, that is your driveway. You can't see it. It's in between. Ah, uh, only I can see it. India Jones. The well known. Oh, we're at sixty printers on battery. <laughs> but I loved you. Oh, look at this fire. This is good. This is like uh, mighty number nine. You got some pizza fire. Delicious. Those actually look like GeoCities website effects. Good. I always wanted horror games represented in the form of GeoCities. You know, we should get on that. Did they just run out of pictures in, in this room? They're like, we could have gone to Google and just gotten spooky pictures to put in these frames, but we didn't. We didn't. It would just be spookier without them, we thought. It was a design choice. Like, come on, there's like 50 pictures of, of Sasquatch and Jeff the Killer and the Rake you could put in these in these frames. Really, is that all I'm supposed to do in this room, is just look at that? Hmm. Hmm. GeoCities Games presents. I don't know, I just, Indian Jones was, it sounded funny to me, Muscles. This door is locked. Like Bollywood Jones. I'm sure there's probably definitely that. That movie exists. Oh, wait, 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 wait. The key led me over here. I went into the spooky room with the brink, the brink, the blank frames. This door is locked. Angel fire still exists? Jesus. Plus by an angel. Oh, that frame made a different color, though. Oh, there's a switch on the wall. Look, it's it's, uh, it's Gears icon. The gear switch. They didn't give me any numbers at any point. Why is that? Why is the one like completely different texture? <laughs> oh, that was a great error noise. <laughs> it sounds like a fucking Daft Punk song. There's more happening here. Oh, I like this font. What the fuck? What? The fuck is happening here? Remember what I was saying about the, the awful pictures? They, they did it. I am alive. Look out and find me. 
waiting for you, before it finds you, hiding in the shadows. Hate is burning deep. Hmm. What's going on here? Oh, yeah, spooky. These aren't even that... These are just dumb. Almost boobs. It's... You don't even know. It's just like a person in a... Like a fucking flesh suit. It could be a fucking alien. It looks like an alien. Look at the hand. Alright, what, what are the numbers? Hate is burning deep. Um. Come to me, my love. It's the only way. I love how it's like switching through the pictures. I guess that is it supposed to be scary or? All right, for real though, the numbers. What the fuck? There's no indication. Am I? Gonna, are we gonna start adding up letters and, and numbers from the alphabet? I don't understand what they want me to do. You think the one with the woman and the baby is kind of spooky? Come on. No, that is the worst one. It's just like a dumb picture that someone added like a dumb filter to. It literally is like a Snapchat filter on a normal picture. I think. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. I'm pretty... It probably looked creepy on its own. I'll give you that. Before they added the Snapchat filters to it. Of course, it switches to that one immediately. That's not even scary. What is that? This is so bizarre. Like, that one's kind of cool. That one's just stupid. That looks like it's from, like... That just looks like a Silent Hill monster. Like a bad Silent Hill monster. A later Silent Hill monster. That looks like someone from The Watchmen or something like that. That one's cool just because it's... Looks like someone actually put work into it. Same with that one. I, that, I don't understand this one. I don't, it looks... Okay. The one with the, the shadow people in the eyes, that's kind of cool, I guess. Alright, and no one has any ideas on this one? Can we get it? Combined intellect to figure out this combination. Any ideas? I, I have no idea. I'm about to say it's all the ellipses added together. We got six, nine, Nah, you can't do anything with the lantern. It's not 420. I tried that one. Okay. Show you the text again. It's just like... Come to me, my love. It's the old... What? Three? Did they really make you wait the whole time? Are they going to just start showing me the numbers now? Dude, this is... This is some fucked up shit. You can get to look at it at a specific angle. Oh, 
Oh, that was a new picture. They're like mouse one on them or something. It's the only way. It like knew. Yeah, no, none of the other ones are happening. Nothing's happening. Hello? 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 It's just three. Okay. You know what? Why not? <sighs> this is so fucking weird. Well, we're waiting. <gasps> yeah, maybe you have to like stare at it. But I was staring at the other ones. Oh, chase her down. Which one was it? We're running out of battery here. Oh, dude, it's this one right here. Oh, because it's her. Uh huh. Three, three, nine. Why so many threes? <laughs> three, three, nine, three. There's a 50% chance the next one's a three. Three, three, nine, three. I did it. I did it. Oh no. Oh no, it's Geo, dude. <laughs> oh my god, what is happening? Okay, I didn't turn that sound all the way down. <laughs> Literally, I put the sound down to where my battery was at. And it's still piercing my ears. Um. This is like your classic. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what the fuck? And then the game crashed. Literally, that's what happened just now. Uh, do I just let it go? What's with the music? Is it just gonna do this forever? I think it died. All right, well, that was, uh, that was a game called Your Last Day. That was the last day that that game is going to be played on my computer ever. I'm going to delete it right now. All right, the next one's called When Nightmares Come True. Uh... 
Um, if I can get it to run. Don't play this game if you have epilepsy or heart problems. All right, guys. Um, when nightmares come true. All right, let's do this shit. What's up? That's the whole game. Oh no. Yeah, that game is running like complete shit. Hold up. We'll put that back at the end of the pile. We'll just shuffle that one back in. Just right back in there. Alright, this one's called The Witching Hour. Mm. The Memphis Game Developers present. Let me just turn that down. Okay, so. Oh. Some people's names. She hates noises. She loves gigantic fucking candles, though. That seems like a fire hazard. So what happened to your couch? Also, the music is already incoming jump scare. Oh. <laughs> oh, bless, bless you. Bless your heart. She lives in the house. <laughs> I got the, the clock. It's even like a little broken on it. Like every, make sure all the the assets have a little bit of rust on them. It's important that everything looks damaged. It needs to look lived in. She still lives here, though. What am I supposed to do? Oh. The kettle was about to go. So items start to make noise and you have to hit them before she kills you. Interesting. These are all her kids. It's because of them. Yeah, that, that's a baby. Did it just go on forever like this? Not the hair dryer, no. This hair dryer, though. These things are fucking dare like real dangerous. It's a pirate hair dryer, yeah. The skull and crossbones. Some fucking edgy goth girl's hair dryer. To be fair, where else are you gonna put your stickers?
if not on your hair dryer. We got to tell people who we are with our stickers. All right. Well, I think I've I've seen the game. I'm glad it took I'm glad it took seven or eight people to make this. That's cool. It's the fucking hair dryer. What the fuck are you guys trying to tell me? Don't dry your fucking hair. Yeah, not bad though. You know what? It was functional. It did a thing. It didn't have like a weird ass story going on that, you know, needed to be deciphered through several different critical lenses. It just worked. I'll give him credit for that. Especially, I think that was for a game jam, maybe. If, if it was for a game jam. I think that makes sense. Uh, this one's not even showing up. This game uh, was made in the horror engine. The 100% original horror game. You guys are going to love this. Hold on, let me just start it over. So you get, you see it from the beginning. Created with the terror engine. I'm sorry, not the horror engine, the terror engine. So there's an engine that's just for, for horror games. Someone streamlined this whole process. I see Slender Man. I don't know who the other guy is. Just a man in a hoodie. Or is that one of his like proxies? That's what it is. All right. Well, I like the font over here. I can definitely see what's happening. <laughs> Work in progress. It's just like underneath it. <laughs> it's underneath it. Oh my god. Well, we want to tell them that this game isn't done yet. Alright, just put it under the title. What'd you say, sir? Put it under the title. Okay. Literally under the title. The theme for tonight is dense frames, okay? So I'm just taking a minute to, to dissect this. You need to analyze it and look at it. I went to college, okay? This is what we learned to do there. It's totally a relevant skill. Select a level. The Asylum. Jeff the Killer. <laughs> Why is he off center like that? Oh my god. The forest Slenderman, just like a random stolen Slenderman picture. Unknown. F f f f Fisco clown. Fisco clown. Fis Fizzico clown. How would you say that? Fizzco clown? How do you spell psycho so wrong? Fight. You sound it out. Fiso? Fizco? Is that li literally who he is? The Fizco clown? Like the Cisco kid? <laughs> oh, my. The exit is locked. Find the key and avoid the clown. Uh, first of all, I need to turn that the fuck down. He's got a scythe.
Isn't that clown from something? Where the fuck is he from? Is it the cloud from One Piece? It did kind of look like it. Get out before he kills you. Okay. Well, this is very disorientating. I think there's two of them. Listen, I got your key. What else do you want me to do? Booger! His special ability is to not really care that I'm here, apparently. I don't feel like I'm being chased, I just feel like he's tolerating me. The big house of toleration. Is that a word? Is toleration a word? It has to be, right? You can conjugate that word that way. What in toleration? I've had enough of this. I'm gonna give myself to the clown. Yeah, he doesn't even care. We just kind of exist here together. And I'm gonna walk into you now. What the fuck was that? Like, what kind of abrupt noise? Alright. Slenderman time. There's just like, Meh. no, here we go. Ah, uh, wow. Why is why am I seeing through a camera, Doctor Professor? With that fucking three months. Thanks for resubbing, dude. dude. Are those my eyelashes? What the fuck? Why is my eye so hairy? Or is that just like Slenderman's ability to make hair pop out of my eyeball? Oh man, we got hairy eyes. Get the we gotta get the cure. Collect it. Ah! Every time you see him, the hair on your eyeballs just grows uncontrollably. Oh, he's just lied never f so closely towards me. Uh. Oh no. Also, the things don't go away. They're still sitting there. Do I just have to get any of them? I think it's anything. This isn't really that. He's not really getting any closer to me. <laughs> it's just like fucking two feet away from me. <laughs> this is like Slender Man on ice. Okay, so they did actually take the things away. I think I need one more. But they didn't take the red part away. Also, the head bob. One, I thought I just need one more minute ago. 
Dude, this is ridiculous. Oh, there it is. You collected all the pages. What the fuck font is this? That's it. I don't know if I should be disappointed or happy. No image available. What if I just do the select a level level? Uh-oh. Did I just break the game? By loading a level that doesn't exist? <laughs> Oh my god. This is the scariest one, dude. Alright, obviously I fucked up. Hold on a second. Alright. How do you edgelords not know bleeding cowboy font? I know, right? I tried to play this select a level level that doesn't have an image. So I won't do that. Alright, well we gotta go back to Slenderman. I just need to complete this story. My hairy eyes! <laughs> oh, I got a cop. Oh, my God. I had to cough after I just couldn't stop laughing after that. All right. And Jeff the Killer. There was like a golden eye sound effect. I like this door texture. Do I just live in a giant bathroom? Mm-hmm. Dude, that was like coloring book tier. Picked up a key. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, that was a vector of Jeff the Killer, yep. Oh, uh, no. I know, it looks like poop a little bit. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Why? Why is it like this? Oh, thank God. Hey! 
Up and at him. It's breakfast time. What the fuck? There wasn't even anything to get away from. This that was what the fuck was that? I don't even know what to say. You overcame him for now. What what the fuck? I would go back in and see what the death screen was, but there wasn't anything even happening. Wow, I'm, that's just disappointing. Just a hundred percent. All right. Mr. Ankrey's wild ride. The fuck is that? Hold on a second. All right. Mr. Anchory's Wild Ride. Here we go. Going in. Everything is rusty. <laughs> <laughs> oh the my door god. Opens. What? The door closes. The door opens. <laughs> the door closes. The door opens. The door closes. The door opens. The door opens. Okay. What the fuck? Hmm. A picture of rust. Is that a different voice? It's just a picture of rust. Dude, how interesting can this be? Still, just a picture of rust. Wait, am I sure this is just a picture? Could just be a dirty mirror. Nah, must be a picture of rust. But is it though? Kinda looks like a mirror too. I'm really starting to doubt this now. Could what? it still be called a mirror if it was this dirty? This is too fucked up. How many yeah, dialogues did they record? Picture. I want to stop. Please stop. 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 My uncle touched me as a child. Okay. I have never loved. I am damaged goods. God is dead. Maybe I should Kill stop. Him. Maybe I should just stop clicking on this. It never ends. I want to get off Mr. Ankrey's wild ride. Is this the whole game? I want to get off. Is this it? It's literally not doing anything now. What the fuck is this? The door closes. That's a different voice, right? The door opens. Is that the narrator? The door opens you know what they say the door closes and then the door opens that's what they say that's life the door opens welcome to the talk show platypus radio hello hello i am boris rustman i am rust specialist for ruslandia Thank you. I'm sure that's a real country and a real job. Um, and I would uh -huh. ask you more about your job, but it doesn't sound very interesting. So I'm just going to ask you other questions that are more relevant to my interests. As what? Would you rather age from the neck up only or the neck down only? I would want to age only on neck. Neck is beautiful. What? I, uh, yeah, okay, okay, yeah. 
Well, well, I mean, you work in a job that sounds very tedious and kind of boring. It is fun. But... Okay, I guess so. Um, what? If you think so. But what is the longest amount of time that you've slept for? I sleep once, four hours. My mom what? come in angry. I need to do more rust work. Oh. I see. Um, so, so what is the biggest physical challenge that you have faced? Rust heavy. Uh, do, I, I don't really understand what that's supposed to mean. Um, rust is something... No, let's not go into rust. I, 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 I've had... What is with the rust? What, what, what position do you usually sleep in? I sleep in fetal position. It is good for back and neck. I don't think that's... I also true. cry. Oh, it's don't st stop crying. It's, uh, don't, don't do that. It's weird. Um. The door opens. Rust is an iron oxide, usually a red oxide formed by uh, the red... The door? I suddenly find the rotation of rocks quite interesting. What? The door opens. What the fuck? What? Why are there controls in here? What is this game? <laughs> Please. The door opens. Let me help. I'm just a radio? Oh, it's a rotating rock. The door opens. Um... The door? Which door is the right one? The door is locked. Alright, welcome today to the... The door is locked. The, the door is locked. With me here today, the door is locked. Is what the fuck the door is, is locked. locked. The door is locked. Uh, the door is locked. Show. The door is locked. Uh, the door is locked. This is the worst thing I've ever played. The door is locked. 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 The door? Put the bunny back into the box. Why was this in the horror section? Just because of how bad it was? What the fuck? The door opens. The door unlocks. Oh, because it has a key. Uh huh. Uh huh. The door. Everything is upside down. The door opens. <laughs> I just killed you. <laughs> All right. Next game. That was Mr. Ankry's wild ride, and it was man, one of the worst things I've ever seen in my life. I feel like a part of my soul just left my body. Oh, man. All right. <laughs> this one's called Lighthouse. Oops. <laughs> oh, my God.
<laughs> Me and my wife Rachel went on our honeymoon trip to Japan. <laughs> What the fuck is that? On the third day, we decided to rent a boat and go to one. Why would it be all English on the boats? It's not Japan. That is not Japan, I'm saying. I'm gonna have to call that it is not Japan. After just one hour of sailing, a big storm hit our boat. A big storm hit our boat. This is just some kid Rachel playing guitar in his room, too. Fear. I tried to pull her over the deck, but then the boat turned upside down, and I didn't manage to hold her hand. I fainted. I thought I was dead. But here I am, the wreck of the rented boat. The wreck of a rented boat. We went to Japan. Hmm. So my wife died. We're just abandoning her. Okay. My wife. She died. In the boat. Also, that is a fucking small boat. Oh yeah, I see the damage here. The boat started mutating. My wife! Ah, the boat. Where's my wife? Rachel, are you here? Rachel. Oh, what? Did I just do like a fucking somersault? <laughs> oh my god! What the fuck was that? Rachel, are you here? Fucking somersault. Woke up on a fucking table. Internship, day 12. I saw a brain transplant today. It failed, but it was fascinating. The blood, the screams. So exciting. The man was still moving for a while after the brain was removed. <clears throat> I forgot the door of lock password again and couldn't bring Mrs. Godoy, the antidote. <sighs> Too bad another subject died because of me. I know it's their destiny, but I feel bad wasting meat like that. Besides, how hard is it to remember the password? It's always the current year. Fresh blood arrived today. Of course, I had to spill some. Miss Godoy was so mad. She told me that she'd put me in capsule cleaning duty if I messed up something like that again. I'm better than that. And those capsules are disgusting. Those people in there are alive and can hear sounds. What if they heard that I broke barrettes yesterday? Maybe I should get rid of them. Uh-huh. Wasted meat. Look at this texture for this fucking table. Like hardly there. I broke the burritos. I already fucked it up. <laughs> uh. What? What year was it? Did they say in the beginning of the game what year it was? Oh, it's 2003. <laughs> this is the fucking Lorem Ipsum fucking fill-in. Virus 6. Blood type B. They literally didn't even change that. Like, they took this page. This must have been, like, a Google result. Or they're like, we need to fill in some text here. Uh, like, that's what you use, like, if you're building a website and you want to show all the fields filled out or something like that. Or uh, you're formatting a paper or something like that and you want to show the f actual format without putting the fucking 
the text in there that you were going to type or whatever. I don't know. That's fucking ridiculous that they would do that. That's funny as fuck to me. Like, you could do anything else. Anything else. Uh, what? They just opened this window. They didn't actually open the door. Oh, am I supposed to throw, like, this fucking chair through it? Excuse me? Fuck. Uh, what? I can't do anything. Also, this looks funny. This like observation light. It just looks like a big a big weird light nipple. I think this game's pretty broken. I don't think this game works. I also want to try something else instead of just walking into that. I put in 2003 and nothing happened. Just opened up like this observation window. No, the keypad doesn't even work anymore. Maybe I should get rid of them. It just works. I want to see what happens if you go up to the lighthouse. Because the game was called Lighthouse. I mean, we're probably in the lighthouse. Oh, there's a continue option. <laughs> Look at the fucking fonts on these. <laughs> Full screen, just like fucking type like eight times there. Oh, nice. It skips all the beginning. Maybe someone lives there. The lighthouse. Maybe somebody lives there. Bunny happen. Like, there's a path. I'll just go up to the lighthouse. This way is blocked. <laughs> its voice is so good. This way is blocked. Not if I can help it. I'm trying to boundary break here, man. Let me break. Alright, this is the best part. Rachel, are you here? <laughs> <laughs> Rachel, are you here? Alright. Virus 6. 2003. That's it. That's the whole game. That's, that's the game. Rachel, are you here? Jesus Christ, dude. Lighthouse. Good shit. Good shit. Oh. What's that? 
Uh, this one's just called Fearful. Let's turn that down. They didn't set my headphones on kind of high, too. Yeah, they do. Okay. Oh, it did that sound effect. What the fuck? Am I a baby? Celtic symbols on my bed. Fucking tiny. That frog looks scary, kinda. Pretty sure that's a frog. One frog. Two. Pencils. Grab the lantern by clicking M1 and E to ring it and find other objects. Whoa. Oh, I love when they do that. When you can like just like kick all the letters. Ah, oh, they went back so quick. What the fuck is this game? What the fuck? Huh? Oh yeah, Rubik's Cubes. Definitely an infant's toy. What the fuck is this game? Is this a is this a chow? Whoa. What the fuck? Hold M1 and press M2 while the blue line is shown. Throw the lantern onto the target. In the light, nothing that scary anymore. Is that what that says? Is that like a giant leader's M or something? Oh, it's a chair. Okay. Yeah, I never played that among the sheep game. Okay. The fuck? This is bizarre. What? The Lego wall? The Lego cave? Bear, what is going on here, dude? So, you have to, like, get up to the bear. It's like a kind of like a little puzzle game. But you have light, for some reason, that you can use. It's like sonar, almost. Creepy doll. Oh shit, that thing's a monster. Did you see that? It's a fuck it's a mimic. Oh yeah. That was a crazy episode. 
And he like lays down in bed and like sees all sorts of weird shit. It's a fucking mimic. I wonder if I could use it to get into the chair. Yeah, I'm not, Stu. I don't think that was the same episode, but that was scary too. I'm not Stu. <laughs> like in 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 and Stu turns into like the fucking weird guy. Hmm. Alright. I think the I think the bear may be leading me astray. Some kind of devil. Drink me! The light can reveal what you thought was never there to begin with. Throw a Lloyd Talisman at it. Yeah, Ragnarok is fucked up, man. Am I supposed to like jump onto this plane? Uh, what is this? Is this a new game element there's around me? What does this say? The light can reveal what you thought was never there to begin with. Mm -hmm. Like the plane I was just walking on. Um, it's broken. Oh, I see. So now we're platforming. It's kind of cool. Like there, but it's not there. Like, I don't want to step on it when it's not there. Okay. Sliding back down. Are we going that way? Where the fuck are we going? Uh oh. Fell through the wall. Teddy? Uh, this is getting scary. The mimic saved me. And it fell. Making my way downtown here. Oh no, I lost it. There it is. Alright, so where did it go after that? Did it like just go down here? Alright, it lost me. They lost me. Oh, there he is. Okay. I think this is the end. Just get back in bed. How the fuck am I gonna get up there, though? Whoa. Is the chair coming at me this time? Okay. Did it. Now where the 
fuck did it go? You have reached the end of our little playground. Sorry it's so short, but we hope you enjoyed it. Into the void! And that's where it ends. With a bang. Not with a whimper. Yeah, I don't know about that one. It was okay. This one's supposed to be cool, but I think it's all in German. Good thing I uh, I failed German in high school, so we're gonna be fine. Agnes Dahl. Like this filter that follows your mouse. Is to uns weid wir wollten dick nie in mistake lassen. Yeah, I don't know anything that means. Meine Brautwurst is grosser und longer. A lot of uh, dust filters. Can't control any of that. Actually, let me try to fix that real quick. I just turned the resolution all the way down. There's dolls everywhere. Oh no. My dolls. Borset von Agnes. Looks like the piano is playing, but we don't hear anything. That's good. <laughs> it's just totally all German. Whoa. That's uh, just like the conjuring, isn't it? Don't they have the doll in like a case? You lousy, lousy, lousy. Oh shit. Cur to cat. Thank you for that sub. Appreciate it. Wenn du die Seelen Kinder. Something about the children. The children are gonna get them. Looks like a little teacup right there. Oh my god. This one does look kinda cool though. Despite it all being in German. <laughs> that just like came out from behind me. Oh wow, they have a church in their house. A little temple. Some, some of those, yeah, dolls are the worst. I've said it once, but I'll say it again, Chucky. Not Rugrats Chucky. 
the doll Chucky scared me for so long. Oh, they've got a pretty crazy house. Mmm. Of course. So we got a bunch of dolls, a bunch of furniture, cloths. Sheets, rather. Someone's necklace. Yeah, what was the doll in The Conjuring? You lousy, lousy bum. Bum, bum, bum. Oh shit. Curtis Cat, thank you for gifting some subs. To your, to your fellow doll hater. Appreciate that. This is so fucking weird. Maybe I'm a doll too. Oh, Annabelle, that's right, yeah. Which went on to have multiple movies, yeah. But that's like a real thing, like in a case in the, um, what do you call it's house? And what's her name's house? The ghost hunting people. The lady who's in all those movies and stuff. And all the shows. See, I know Liba means love. Love, rather. Love. That's pretty much it, though. Into the fire. We got some upside down crosses. We got all the good shit. Yeah, I don't know what you're supposed to do. I feel like I kind of looked through everything. Oh, there's a door. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay. There's more dolls. Oh, that one's gonna go. There's like sitting behind books. This is a weird living room setup. Am I like casting a spell right now? Oh shit. I think we just brought a doll to life. Can't see anything. I can't see a damn thing. Am I supposed to do something now? This is bizarre. Like there's stairs here, but they don't they don't work. Let me just go down this hallway. Okay. Oh, okay.
The fuck? This is so stupid now. Just finding shoes in a in a sewer. It's weird. This one on H had like really high phrase too, and people are like, "I just I can't wait for the English translation." I, wow, this game. Just like, mm hmm. You cannot leave yet. Oh, I didn't get the shoe. Hmm. Oh shit! Carried a cat. I wonder what that. That nine ninety nine sub, damn! Thank you so much for the support. Oh, that shoe! I think I, I think there must have been a few that I missed. Maybe you can sell you could sell those shoes for like ten bucks. You think so? The doll shoes? The hot commodity these days. Oh my god! Why the doll shoes, though? Baby shoes for sale. Never worn. Where the fuck are the rest of these? That must have been the last one. What is that, a Hemingway poem or something like that? There's one. I'm pretty sure it was Hemingway. Almost there. Someone asked Hemingway to write a story in six words. That's what it was. That's what I thought. All right. We're back in the doll world. Now that we went through the doll dream. Now oh, we get some music. I think it must mean go come back here when you find them all. Oh shit. Guten Morgen, Stephanie. Hast du got Geschenflan? Hast du hunger? Ich hab dir Zuzavin gemicht. Whoa! Do these are all toss? Dean Fiberist Rutin Gagen. Bod Gears Dear Vider Besser. There's some good, uh, some good art. But we'll never know what it said. I think it was a story about the mom making the kid to a doll, maybe? Should I translate? Yeah, go for it, Mystic Song, if you if you have anything to add to that. I'm sure there's a few of you who could probably translate some of that. Native Germans or not. Something about a fever. What is that, uh... That psychological thing. I guess it's, uh. I forget what it's called. When the parent, like, abuses the child to get attention. I feel like we've spoken about this before. There's another game we played about it. It was, like, in the sixth sense and stuff like that. I forget how it's explained. Hey, what's up, Mad Bagel? Narcissistic disorder. <laughs> there, I thought there was an actual thing. Munchausen by proxy. Is that what it is?
That's what I kind of got out of that. What do you think? She said, good morning. Are you feeling all right? Are you hungry? You look so much better now. Your fever seems to have gotten better. You will get better soon. Yeah, that's kind of what that feels like to me. I went by so fast I've forgotten some of that guy. I'm pretty sure that's what that was. Alright. Next game. Why there was dolls? I don't know. Maybe it, it gets in, it, it's involved in that somehow. I don't know. Alright, this next one's called Boolean Escape. The Boolean Escape by Dan Sanderson by the Baron Scene Bears. That's it. That's the whole game. Oh, there's a little piss stain over here. Why? What does it mean? You lousy. What does it mean? Bonnie, thank you for gifting a sub to Mystic Song. It was nice of you. Maybe you have to like walk backwards through it. I'm taking suggestions. What? It says an escape room, but there's no. There's nothing else to interact with except for the light. Can't do anything to anything else. Can't do anything with that. now can I like get in here and turn on the light somehow things are happening I think it's just fucking timed is it the same room it is So the painting would be right here. Or right here. No, you can't click on it. Oh, maybe there is a light. Oh wait, I'm an idiot. I didn't see that. <gasps> Can you find a key? Numpad to unlock. Oh, that's pretty cool. 
All right, we gotta find the key. Hmm. Now where the fuck? Bloodroom. So you can't open the door. The blood rooms. the fuck does that mean? I like the way that blood looks. Hmm. Was this on the floor last time? Yeah, that wasn't like that. Getting onto the elevator and the shining. It's reverse shining. It's the shining. Is there someone standing there? Alright, buddy. Commence the lurking. This is weird. Oh, going down? Get rage for this fucking wallpaper, though. Oh. What? Did I not go quick enough? Can you actually get it?
Maybe you have to back out. I feel like it's a part of the puzzle. If it just keeps respawning me. Like if that was the end, it would just end, right? Pog Pog. Okay, man, bagel. Just all about the pogs. They're coming back. Remember Alf? He's back in pog form. Why? Just cycling back and forth between those two now. Can't be that. It has to be this one. But this one doesn't have the door to the hallway. It only happens when you do that. But then you can't go through this door. So what the hell? But that didn't change it that time. It doesn't change the texture of this wall now. You close the door on yourself, you think? Oh no. Can't fix it. Well, it sucks. <clears throat> Now we'll never know.
Maybe there's something I'm missing. No, I don't think so. Code was on the dark wall. I mean, I don't see anything. Hmm. I think, yeah, it must be broken? I'm not sure. This one was kind of neat. Goes. I think it's kaput, man. Have you tried setting the room to Wumbo? I think those bits me just in. Very nice of you. Man, it's a bummer. I think I'm just gonna have to move on. Thank you for the bits. Fearful Windows. Did I already play this one? Oh yeah, 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 yeah we did. Fearful Window. Okay, the ver yeah, all right, all right. Yeah, we played that one. <laughs> it just says like the version operating system is supposed to be four next to it. I think it's zero six zero two two. But that but even if I had the code, why would it matter? Like there was nothing to put the code into. It was bizarre. Um Life to Die Dreams. Oh, it's an EXE. I don't really like those ones. Hmm. Oh, it's a flander. Um, there's another Mr. Ankries game in here. We did the witching hour. When nightmares come true, we did that one. Life to die dreams. Yeah, I don't like when they want to run. An installation now. Yes, exit. Why can't you just be in Unity like everybody else? Hmm. Alright, what the hell is this game? Game contains flashing lights, certain amount of gore. Blood and suggestive unsettling themes, not suitable for audiences near to 18. Therefore, a viewer discretion is advised. Hide. Go away. <laughs> what the fuck? Hi. Hi. Who are you? Who are you? I'm bum. I'm a, a man. I'm a no one. I wish I'd said no one. I 
Oh, the screen capture's not working. That's weird. Hold on. Yeah, you're not really missing much. That's fucking weird. Nah, it's just being a piece of crap. I think I'll just skip that one for now. I think I'll skip that one for now. There we go. So this one, I think I played a while ago. I can't really remember it that well. Edmonton Digital Arts College. So this game in Urbex, which I played a little bit more recently, are kind of like a little duo of games with the mannequins and shit. But I want to just kind of play them together because apparently there's supposed to be like some kind of story between them. And some some good shit here. Storage room is locked. Wow, oh, these filters are crazy. Yeah, the VHSC kind of filter is very popular right now. I like it a lot too. I don't like this place. That's just what, that's all the note says. I don't like this place, W. Good thing you wrote that down. Couple tiny computer monitors. Look at the, like this, it makes that look so strange. I love that. The colors just get turned into little blocks. Mannequin leg. Can I look at the computer? Oh. Pretty sure you guys weren't here last time. It's coming down out there. This side up. Yeah, I like the VHS filters. I mean, personally, I I use that in After Effects a lot. I've gotten a few uh, licenses and templates that you know you can put throw anything into a, these certain filters, and you can apply like the VHS, home movie filters, like DVD filter, uh, bootleg co like DVD concert footage filter. There's a lot of really neat ones. I like messing with stuff like that. And certain things look great and some things do not. Oh no. Okay. Storage key is missing. But we have a key. Mmm. The cup's rolling around. Please clean up after yourself. The monitor had a mannequin face on it, I didn't even notice. Too many mannequins. Mm. 
This is just like straight up uh, the second Silent Hill movie. They just make a warehouse with a bunch of mannequins. The only cool part about the second Silent Hill movie was the mannequin spider thing. That thing was fucking cool. The rest of it was hot garbage. Oh, a key I didn't even need, know I needed. And the mannequin's coming after me now. You I know some people would want to get caught bomb. by the mannequins, huh? You know what I'm saying? Cara to cat! Gift another sub to all corrupting Harlot. Thank you so much. Enjoy those bummy emotes. I think I went back in a circle. Yeah, it, had, it was so bad. It was, it was so bad. I thought the first Silent Hill movie was decent, though. Like, on its own. Not representative of the games or anything, but... Oh, okay. The mannequins are gathering. Connected by a hatred of humanoid objects. They're getting ready. It made the noise, but didn't actually open. For, are those the same emotes from Christmas? Are they still working? Hold on, hold on a second. Hold on. I need to play a thing. Both look the same. End of tape, please rewind. <laughs> <laughs> Please rewind. Good shit. Oh, my BRB screen broke. That's kind of bizarre. It's like my CPU gone nuts. No? Weird. That's bizarre. I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick, and then I'm gonna play the second game by that dev. It's called Urbex. It's like the continuation, I think. It's like the second side of the tape. I'll be right back. I just gotta use the bathroom and stuff. You guys sit tight. Thank you for hanging out. Uh, I'm gonna play a song. I think. Uh, if I can find one. 
Maybe I'll just play that, uh, that Chrono Trigger song again from last night. Alright, I'll be right back.
All right, I'm back. Sorry about that. So this is Urbex. It's supposed to be by the same guy who just made the other mannequin game. All right, Andor, you heading out, man? Take it easy. Have a good night. Thanks for dropping by. Hmm. Hmm. And thank you for the SpongeBob lore. I will never forget. Oh shit! Get yeah, unicorn of love coming in with that five months. Nice to see you. Hope you've been well. Someone's banging. Banging. On a trash can. Banging. On a street light. Come on. Who knows that shit? Oh yeah, there's no VHS filter. What the fuck? the hell? We're in DVD mode now? <laughs> DVD filter? Also, what's up, Tent Moon? I know it well enough to know you did the song wrong. How the fuck is it supposed to go? Banging on a trash can. Banging. On a street light. And then all I remember is think big. Think big. Think big. Think big. And then one little voice is calling me, calling me. Oh shit. I'm telling you, they should hire me for the Doug remake. I just want to sing Doug songs all day. Drumming on a street light. Oh, that's how fuses work. Isn't that basically what the song is? Yeah, I think so. It's a killer tofu idea. Mmm, indeed. Let's have some just punk raka. What am I supposed to be doing here? He said this was better than his last game. I'm going to have to go ahead and disagree. It may have been shorter, but it was more dense and compact. It was like a real thing. You watched part of a VHS the other day. How did we do it? How did we watch Titanic like 50 times and it looked like that? I think the first showing of a VHS was different back then, too. It looked better, first of all. And you just kind of dealt with it, I think, as a kid, too. Like, I don't know. You're right. The day do not look great. They do not look good. It's more the sound, too. The sound is just not great. I feel like I'm in a kitchen and people are, like, dropping the dishes and stuff. Look at this, look at this fucking electrical box. It's just got like giant wires in it. And it all depended on what you had too, like... I think not all VHSs were made equally and stuff like that. Some were really bad, like some were, some people had VHSs that were from like when they first came out and they are like gigantic and fucking awful. This is just like wander around spooky sounds generator game. Mm -hmm.
all the stools have that same, like, fucking piece of styrofoam ripped out. Dang bag! This city just, like, starts outside that door. Hmm. Oh, a door. It doesn't open. This one's called Urbex. Urban Exploring. Help me, I got drunk and I wandered into this factory and I can't find my way out. I need more allowance, yeah. That was a good one. I think I know the words more than that one than the others. Damn it, back at the fucking beginning. I need more allowance. This is this is insane, man. This is insane. You're really into urbixing, Mad Bagel? I've gone a few times. It's fucking crazy. Oh, did my flashlight die? No. It depends on where you go, I guess. There's some really dangerous places around here. Um. As far as, like, getting arrested and shit like that goes. I think I've told a few stories about Dudley Town. That's not really urban exploring, but it's still, like, if you go there and they catch you, you definitely get arrested for trespassing. Um, excuse me. I went all the way to the end of the map. Nothing happened. Maybe there's like another fuse. Oh, what the fuck? No, it's a can. Well, that's the whole game. Hmm. I think I've told that story a few times, but like, uh, Dudley Town is a place in Connecticut that, you know, was like a small town mid 1800s or something like that that just kind of popped up. There's a few of those, obviously, in all over the country. And then as people move towards, like, more populated areas, some of the small towns in between just became ghost towns and, like, disappeared or, you know, just, like, a few structures there. Anyways, there's all sorts of stories about it. So I kind of live near there. And... People go up, oh, there's another fuse. People go up there and fuck around all the time. It's pretty far away from everything. Oh, shit. Then it's owned by a place called Dark Woods uh, Association or something like that. Like, oh my god. Was that a fucking eye robot? Dude, these aren't just mannequins. These are not just mannequins. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Are you guys familiar with a little movie called I, Robot? Uh, with a little actor called Will Smith? Huh? Have you heard of him? Hold on. We've got a little we've got a little problem here.
I don't know. Wasn't the robot and I, I robot, wasn't that mo capped by uh, Andy, Andy Circus? Wasn't that like one of his first mo cap roles? I said his last name, right? The, they've gained sentiments. Whoop, 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 whoop. Dan, thank you for those 200 bits. Every mocap ever is Nandy, yeah. He was he was Snook too, right? More recently. Did that just go through my chest? Was that what that was supposed to be? Wow. So basically, wander around the dark for 15 minutes. And then get fisted? Good. Good shit. Dude, my BRB screen is like broken. How is that possible? That doesn't, that like hard drive start dying or something? That is bizarre. I've never had that happen to me. I'll just go back to the fire. All right. Get the fuck out of here. Urbex. I would have to say, dude, that is not your better of the two games. The first one was like a million times better. He's in Black Panther. He's actually playing a person. He doesn't play. He's not Tombs in X-Files, is he? Hold on. Let me look this up. Hold on a second. Wrong song. Why is that Parasite Eve song even on the list? Get it out of there. Uh, Tombs in X-Files. Actor. No, it's not Doug Hutchinson. Who? Doug Hutchinson? Why does that sound familiar? Oh, he's the one that was married to Courtney Stoughton. Dude, Tombs in X-Files is the one that can, like, become, like, a lizard, and he, like, travels through the ventilation shafts and stuff like that to kill people. Has anyone ever seen that episode? That's who Andy Circus looks like to me. Let me look this up again. Uh, no, not at all, actually. Not even a little bit. I don't know why I thought that that's what he looked like. Well, anyways. It was Alan... Tur oh, that's who, uh, that's who I got mixed up with. Alan was... Uh, Alan was the robot in Rogue One. And he's done a bunch of other mocap stuff. I think that was like reading an interview and I got them like mixed up in somehow. In my mind. Okay. Okay, here we go. I've got... I think this is the last one, honestly, for the night. Possibly one more after this. Alright. Let's do this shit.
Press F to pay. Come on, they didn't do that. That's on purpose. Also, the game is not working. And it crashed. Welcome. Oh, no. I have a feeling I am supposed to collect. Hold on, let me turn down the sound. Oh yeah, this is Mr. Anne McCree again. Four radio parts? I have a feeling I'm supposed to collect... Are those hands? How? <laughs> it's a big rat. Oh, the cursor will go out. A rat head. This was a very loud rat. Maybe it's a rodent's head. Uh. No rat can get that big. No rat. Who would have found this large rat? It has to be a stuffed horse head that has been carved into a rat's head. I still think it's a rat's head. Sounds like Daniel from SL. A rat's head can't be this interesting. Why am I still looking at this rat's head? Like, occasionally. Can rats get this big? Like, when he says that, like that, sounds like Daniel from SL. No way, ho, say. <laughs> Why do they call it a rat if it's that big? I refuse to believe this is a rat. This can't be real. Skaven, ratatat, ratatat. These are all. These are all appropriate answers. This can't be a rat. It could mow down entire civilizations. Rat is tar backwards. This could mean something. Probably doesn't though. How many fucking voices did they record for this? Ratat. This was a very loud rat. Oh, it started over. The, the door closes. The door opens. He did it again. The door closes. The door opens. The door opens. That's his fucking signature move. The door opens. The door opens. The door, the door, the door, the door, open the door, 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 the door opens. The fuck? What did I just pick up? The door. The door closes. The door. <laughs> the door. What did that just say? Did it say like the name of the company? Banana. Is that like a microphone? That's a nice light. The door opens. The door closes. Yeah, the fire hands too. I can't kind of get over this. This is probably the coolest thing about the game. So we got fire hands. We got doors opening and closing. It's a rodent set. A rodent's head. The door unlocks. The door unlocks. The door opens. How can perspective be real if our eyes aren't real? <laughs> okay, so they're aware of what they're doing here. The door 
opens. They're well aware. Oh, shit. Whoa. What is perspective? The door. Welcome opens. to the Dormant Door talk show. Uh, I have a guest today. Uh, I don't know what his name is. Why is he doing this uh, again? I know he's a sailor. The door. But, uh, let's opens. get straight into it. Uh, what is your name? Uh, are you asking for my name? Yes. Uh, oh, it is. Uh, The door opens. Hmm. It's a. Uh, it's flim. What the fuck? Flimstukir. So that's a family name. Yeah. I thought I got all the things. So uh, you are a sailor by uh, trade. I am a sailor. I've been to sea many times. I love the sea spirit in my face. The door. So you've locked. been many times to sea, you say? Yes, yes. I'm a sailor. I love the oh, sea right, spirit yeah, yeah. in my face. Uh, what, what is your specific job? On the um, boat. I... The door opens. I am here, the door but where are you? Opens. Huh? Welcome back to the Dormant Door. With me here today I have a... Telephone Tower Climber. You the door uh, opens. Hello. Hello. My name is Jürgen Stiffclimber. <laughs> Jürgen Stiffclimber. Yep. Mm. And you climb telephone poles. Yep. Nice. All right. There's someone Curious. whispering. Does it pay well? I get mm. by. So. Hi. Very hi. Um, is it uh, not at all? Uh, Concerning climbing these, where, where are the other things? What yeah, do I need yeah, still? Sorry, mm. Concerning, but uh, you know, I don't climb a lot. You don't climb a lot. But do I like goodbye here somehow? What do I do? I have no hands. See, see, see this, see this. Mm. Very strong. Wow. So you Screen capture for us? Looks alright, I know BS to me. And your waist. Um, you know, I, a touch thing. Um. Oh, wait. I just actually scrolled up my fucking chatty by accident. I was reading what Harg said like my fucking friend, an hour ago. Thing to waist. Mm. And puts it onto the telephone clamping pole. Mm. And then I push with waist and strong legs. Mm. So it's kind of like thrusting and clamping. Yes. Mm. All right, I don't know where the other right. things are. Uh, this uh, job seems to be... The thrusting and clamping. Be, uh, quite uh, short-lived, as in you don't uh, last long in this job. Many people don't uh, last that long. Mm. Uh, another hearts. Mm. I think that's it what because is my the door accent a lot. closes. Right. Unless something get back here somehow. Right. I imagine. I, br I brought them with me though. Did you bring your hands? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I got them here. I got them here. Right. See. Si. Can't go that si. way. I have one hand. Oh, there's a way. Oh right my hand. god. You see, it fits perfectly here. Mm. Didn't even then see I got this. my left hand. The door opens. There we go. The door opens. The door unlocks. The door, the door unlocks. Opens. How many grapes do you think I can fit into my mouth? It's supposed to be Shrek. Name. I don't think uh, these guys should probably make Sebastian any more Crow. video games. Sebastian Crow. Hmm. 
Because this is awful. I don't even know if this is a game, really. Like, were people supposed to play this, or is this like an inside joke? Long time. You could say that, yes. Mm. Oh, I forgot that thing. Very long. The door. Very long. Locks. So it's been your whole the career. Uh, Did they just see like yes. what they could do. My with, mom like, dropped me career. as an adult. The door opens. Like when does it end? The door opens. The door opens. Motherboard! What? The door opens. Astronaut to talk to. So, what is your name? Um, uh, the door opens. Uh, the door. The door opens. The door opens. See ya. What's that? I'm in a hole now. <laughs> this developer is living in 2090. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Alright, I got one more, I think. Spooky seller. If it works. Oh, uh, no, it's not working. Yeah, that's not happening. That one's not working either. That one's called Mr. Ancree's House of Illusions. Not sure about that one, man. You lousy not lousy sure lousy. about that one. Oh, shit. Mad Bagel just gifted a sub to uh, me just in. Thank you so much, Mad Bagel. That's nice of you, dude. I'm trying to see if I have one more here that I haven't played. Mr. Increase, Lighthouse, Life to Die Dreams. No, that one was not good. Bully and Escape, that one broke. Dull. When Nightmares Come True, 